Welcome everyone, this is uh, Frank and Luke Reviews. I'm Frank. I'm Luke. And today we're going to bring to you the mobile phone telescope. So Luke, can you do me the honor of opening it up? Yeah, He's our model. Sure. Ooh la. By Hi-Zek. Alright, let's open this up. Also, just to mention, these reviews are being provided um, without influence from the seller. We have no direct uh, relationship with the seller or the listing on Amazon. Uh, we're here to just provide you uh, a way to review a product before purchasing or maybe after purchasing, getting a more in-depth look into the product for how you can use it uh, in your day-to-day. -day. And so, uh, yeah, let's get started. Yeah, uh, thank you for mentioning that, Luke. So, we purchased this with our own money uh, we did not get it uh, for free or anything like that. So we love gadgets, as you guys know. We yeah. got Apple watches. <laughs> um, we are techs. Um, we used to work. For <laughs> we love the technology, so we decided to just get cool products, review them, so that our viewers get some value out of the channel, and then we'll be providing you the link, which um, sends you to the pro the. Um, the uh, listing of the product that we showed to you and whether you buy it or not is up to you. If you do buy it, we'll get a small commission so that way we can continue buying more products in the future. That's right. And some of them we buy for our own personal use. The, one that we, the ones that we don't, we give them away. So always at the end of the channel, we'll let you know if we're giving away the, uh, the product and a lucky winner will be able to enjoy it for themselves. Cool? Very cool. All right. So tell me about uh, the product, Luke. Yeah, so uh, just to mention quickly, it comes with a little pamphlet so you can see uh, how to use it and also that they have more products of a similar nature for you to get if you like it. So it looks like you get the um, telescopic lens with uh, lens caps, so it's really nice for transport, avoid scuffing and damaging the lenses on either side. So if we pop those off, there we go. Safety, very important when it comes to lenses. Yeah, so you definitely don't want to put your fingerprints on the lenses, otherwise you'll have to uh, clean it with the cloth and it might not come out su super well, especially the oil from your fingers, so do be careful about that. Uh, comes with a clip uh, to really work with any phone um, really easily, with or without a case, which is a big benefit, because a lot of them you got to take your case off, it's not that great. Um, so it actually screws into the one side of the clip, so let's screw that in right away. And that's got a really simple clip to adjust uh, to the thickness of your phone. So if you use, um, for example, uh, the phone we have here for demo, just want to pass that to me, thank you. Uh, you can see it just clips on really easily to the front or back camera. We'll be using the back one today. And if I pull up the uh, camera here, booyah. Perfect, so it does take a little bit of work to uh, align it, but once it gets aligned, it pretty much stays in place pretty well. And um, we'll provide some uh, screenshots uh, in the editing for you to see what we're yeah. seeing here. Uh, mm -hmm. So super simple, as you can see, we're getting the preview uh, with the telescopic lens. Exactly. And uh, we're on the 14th floor here in the building, so... Actually, uh, what's let's up? activate the screen recording. So oh, that's that, a great uh, idea. They can see exactly what you're looking at. It's already done. Yeah, perfect. So there we go, we'll uh, add that in post. Um, so I definitely do suggest holding it uh, with your left or right hand uh, between two fingers to keep it steady because while you adjust the zoom function of the lens, uh, that's definitely going to be a lot simpler um, to do both at the same time because otherwise it can move around a little bit. So yeah, as you guys can see in the screen recording, we get a really cool telescopic lens that uh, can zoom in on objects uh, several hundred feet away. Yeah. pretty easily it's pretty intense so, so like, to clarify yeah the the phone obviously has an autofocus but because we're adding a module to the camera you got to focus that module yourself which is why Luke puts the fingers one at the bottom one at the top to keep it steady because the clipping it's not it secures it but it does not it's not strong enough for you to hold it in place while you are um, focusing the actual module so you definitely want to use this technique. It works flawless, and as you guys will see soon enough on the on the recording for the screen, you will be able to see that uh, it works well. Now, you will also see on the screen that the <clears throat> the actual screen shows black uh, contour, 
That's because the hole itself, it's not bigger than the camera. So you will see a little bit of black around the screen, but it's normal. It's, it does not mean that local look didn't put it properly. It's usually is that the actual hole is a little bit smaller, which is fine because it, it looks as if you're actually looking through a telescope. So it's perfect. Exactly, and uh, <laughs> this could be a great uh, spy camera addition to your phone, as well as maybe bird watching, or you want to take uh, maybe some sports shots, you're at a live sports event or something, um, or maybe you're super far from a stage at a rock concert, something like that, you can get some really great video um, or photos that make you feel like you're right up front, uh, but in reality mm -hmm. you might be far further away. Um, so again, this could take uh, easily photo or video, whatever mode uh, you like on your phone, and it's really the attachment uh, doing all the work for the focus. Definitely, as you're going to see in the screen recording, uh, any slight shake is really amplified because yeah. of the zoom you're doing. So definitely using a tripod um, or something similar um, to really keep the device steady is optimal. Uh, but you can still get really great uh, photos. So for example, if I take some photos that will maybe uh, in post pop up as a still. So let's say I focus in on this apartment building. Let's see if the, uh, we've got an iPhone 6S here. Let's see if that uh, stability is gonna work. So that's pretty good. Yeah, it's not bad. I mean, Luke is barely checking his hand, but on the actual video or on the preview, it moves like crazy, yeah. which is normal given the fact that you have, well, this camera actually has between eight times to 12 times. You have, that's well, crazy, it looks yeah. to be two modes, either eight or 12. And the angle of view is nine or 12 degree. So definitely you got two options as for the zoom in, but do use it with a tripod do, uh, with for best results. Yeah. yeah. Otherwise, if you're gonna be mobile, a good general tip to hold your camera steady is you really connect your elbows to your upper body and then hold it like that. You get a really steady shot, uh, even if you don't have a tripod versus trying to hold your hands out uh, straight and that's really gives you a lot more shake, you know? <laughs> exactly, so one last thing I wanted to also mention is they do have 10 different models, as you guys can see here in the um, user manual that they provided. They also show you how to clip it in, but it's, how we just show you, it's pretty self-explanatory. Uh, plus they also have functions, merits, applications, and usage. So it's a nice detailed review and as Luke said before, you got protection on the front and back, yeah. and also the micro cloth to clean it up, which is always nice. And uh, let me go look through the actual listing to mention anything else that we have, may have missed. Yeah, for sure. That is mentioning in the listing. All right, so great image effect, uh, adjustable 12 times zoom lens, careful protection, we talked about that, portable and detachable, yes. And it fits on iPhone 7, 7S, 7 Plus, 6S, 6, 6 Plus, 6S 6 Plus. I would say almost any mobile product, yeah. whether you have a tablet or a smartphone. They do mention um, tablets too. Yeah, because as you can see, it can get pretty thick. So even if you have uh, maybe even a Surface Pro laptop or something you really want to use for whatever reason, as you can see, it can get pretty thick even with a laptop with a case on the screen, for example, if the camera's on the back or the front. Um, so you really have, do have quite a universal application uh, for this uh, yep. telescopic lens. Mm -hmm. All right, everyone. So this one is not a product that we purchase for ourselves. We purchase it for, for this specific video to launch our channel and we want to give it away. So uh, please comment down below stating that you would like to uh, to enter the contest within a week we will select by putting a heart in the comment like just love the comment that's the way we will select it we'll also add a comment saying that you were the winner and yeah we'll be in touch about the shipping and uh, exactly and then we'll, that, you know. yeah we'll contact you if you will we'll try to communicate outside of YouTube to um, hash out the details of how we're gonna send it and uh, but yeah so this won't go to a lucky winner. We'll send you this exact uh, this exact model. So we'll just put it back in the box. What and, you uh, see is what you get, people. <laughs> exactly. So if you see it, that it's open, it's only because it's the same one that we reviewed, but we haven't used it. So you're getting pretty much a brand new product. So like I said, uh, share, comment, like, subscribe, turn on the notifications. So when new videos comes out, you'll be able to see it and also enter the contest whenever we give it away. 
Anything else you want to mention? Yeah, we really appreciate your uh, viewership and uh, more videos to come. So thanks so much for watching and uh, we look forward to more reviews. Thank you very much. Bye guys. Take care.